if Harry does come over for the coronation, I would like you to sit him next to Mike Tyndall. Because he had a go at Princess Anne. Now, that's just my opinion because he doesn't name her in the book. So I may be wrong. I admit I may be wrong. See what you think. But he has a go about this court circular that um, is published yearly and it lets people know how many official engagements each royal member has done for the year. And he made this snarky little comment how, um, you know, some people even get credit for an engagement that catch a helicopter and go and cut a ribbon or open, yeah, no, cut a ribbon on a horse farm. And I immediately thought, oh, Princess Anne. And it was such a snarky comment because she always tops, you know, the number of engagements in the year. And I thought, how weak to sort of have a pot shot, a pointed pot shot at your aunt like that, not have the courage to name her clearly who you're having a go at. So it's sort of like this passive aggressive little snarky comment. Could be wrong if Harry would like to clarify that snarky comment and tell us who he was talking about by all means. Maybe you can leave a comment down below, Harry. <laughs> but it really got my goat because don't have a go at Princess Anne. Can't you be proud of someone that has clearly not done this job to be glamorous, not done this job for personal gain, but done this job to really provide service. She supports so many charities and she finds out a lot of information about every charity and she really contributes. I mean, anyone that works with her says she really contributes. So that just really peed me off, Harry, that you had a go at Princess Anne. So my suggestion for that to the royal family is, if Harry does come over for the coronation, I would like you to sit him next to Mike Tyndall. And Mike, I would like you to read page 237 where he has a go at your mother-in-law and I think you should take any action that you deem necessary. I'll see you again next time. Bye.